Hey YouTube, what's up? It's 0907 J Dog here uh, to bring you some cool things to do with your jailbroken iPod Touch. Uh, there's the first thing I'm going to show you is a thing called Barrel. Um, it helps change your uh, transition, you know, from page to page. It changes it transition. And uh, first thing you're going to want to do is go to search and type and look for barrel barrel see and it's when you pick per, pick it up it's this one it's the iHacks repo one not the boss the other one or whatever it's called this one's the free one it has basically the exact same thing as the other barrel that has the little drill on it or whatever and so basically what this does, you download it and you go to your settings and you go to, down to barrel. Go to barrel and you go to, you can pick from, I personally like the cube, I think that one looks pretty cool. And see cube and then there's like 20 or so different ones. So I pick the cube and see how it like changes it. Oh, yeah, that was the wrong one, probably. Uh, cube outside, I think, is the one I wanted. Uh, yeah, there we go. That's a cool one. See how it has the, like, little, little point like that? Like a cube would? I mean, I like it. It looks pretty cool. And the second thing is the Android lock. There's been... It's pretty cool, actually. Um, I don't know. Um, let's see this. Um, let it load here. Uh, what you're gonna want to do is go to. Uh, first, you're gonna want yeah. Go to sources. You're gonna want to add sinful iPhone repo no dot com forward slash no spaces uh, I'll put it the thing up on the description if you can't see it just sinful iPhone repo <laughs> and you add that source and then you want to search and you would want to go to I think I passed it yep the ant you'd want to get um, Android XT cracked that's what it's gonna look like. It's come. It comes from a sinful iPhone repo, and what it does, you just well how to use it. You just go to your settings. You go to the Android Lock XT, and you go to enable. It turns it on, and then you change your pattern to whatever you want, basically. And you do it twice. And then you're done. One second. All right, there you go. So that's how you do it. Um, you can also change the appearance of like the different boxes and stuff like that. You can select the themes. Um, I have the normal one because I just like it. You can change the behavior, uh, the temps or wrong patterns, the logging. Uh, don't, I haven't really explored it yet, I just barely got this today, um, so, if you would want to learn, to learn more about it, I can look into it more and maybe make another video, just ask in the comments or whatever. Um, then the next thing is, I'm going to talk about today is MX Tube. It is, how you get it is you just go to Cydia. And you go to uh, search. You would search it since I already have it. I'm just going to my packages. And you type in just MX, MX, capital M, lowercase x, no spaces, capital T, U B E, MX tube. And just download it. And what it does is it. Uh, basically like a YouTube type thing you you go home you come here and you go and 
you can get all these different YouTube videos. Um, you can search for a, let's just do, I don't know, let's just, my uh, Tomahawk videos. You type in whatever you want, but for sake of time, Soviet Vector. Um, X Soviet Vector X, and that's my Tomahawk. That's my color Black Ops gameplays and crap like that. And then you just I don't know. Yeah, you just take it. You can stream it, or you can download it. If you wanna uh, download it, you just you know hit download, and it goes into your uh, you know, goes into your little, like, file or whatever. And see, I'll have all these different videos. And you can have, you can basically, it's like a YouTube, basically, you just download. And you take it and you go, you can go places, like, you can go camping. Say you want to watch your favorite YouTube video, show it to somebody when you're camping. Or somewhere that you don't have Wi-Fi, basically. You go and you can take it and... You know, uh, watch it wherever, basically. So, I usually take it to school and watch some videos at school. Um, but yeah, you just click on the one that you want. And you can watch the video. Yeah, it's just like, you can fast forward, uh, pause it. You know, go slow, turn the sound up and down. Once you're done, if you don't want to watch it anymore, just hit done, basically. Brings you back to your videos. And I think that's all I got for you guys today. Peace.